Oh, what is this? Oh! Oh wait, that's right, I killed Alphys, didn't I? And I still don't regret it. Well, I guess I've got to use those platforms to spin across, but that is so much effort, and I'm just not in the mood for that. Oh! A plot device! You're too good, doggy! Ha ha ha! Oh! I'm sorry, doggy, I just, uh... I'm just... tipped him across. Sorry! 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 Oh, hi! Oh, great, if it isn't Goonatron. Megaton! More like a waste of robot parts. Am I right, lads? You are right, lad. Cheers, lad. So what are you doing? Boiling some oil or something? Yeah, um, you're a lot earlier than I expected. I was gonna have you participate in my cooking show. Why? Because I'm kooky. Can you pass me those eggs over there? I don't see why not. Oops, I slipped. I'm such a clumsy individual. But this isn't working how I planned. Okay, I'm gonna fly up here, and you use this jetpack and chase me up to get the prize. If you don't do it, I'll kill you. How's that sound? Yeah, that sounds awesome, man. I'm definitely down for this. Are you ready? Come and get me! Did you hear what they said? Oh, that study about 70% of men being grubbers not showers, right? They said a child wearing striped pajamas will walk through here. I mean, it's more of a t-shirt, but technically you could use it as pajamas. I use t-shirts as pajamas. Is that weird? I don't think it's weird. Apparently they're scared of spiders. Is that so? And apparently they're really stingy with their money. Let me stop you right there. Are you getting this information from my Facebook profile? Uh, no. No. Because I haven't updated that in years. So if you're basing that whole stingy thing off that status that I was tagged in, that was actually sarcasm because I paid for that guy's birth. That day. It's like reverse, you know, because I paid for his whole thing, so he was like, oh, you're so stingy, even though obviously I paid for everything. So it's just a joke, you know what I mean? So that's wrong. As for the spider thing, I'm not scared of spiders anymore. I actually love spiders now. Oh, Muffet added you as a friend. Did you just add me as a friend by accident? My finger slipped! Yeah, alright then. Oh, liking my profile pictures now, huh? My oh, fingers... let me guess, your finger slipped. You're not going any further. I can't wait to eat you. By the way, you know that story that I just told you about me not being scared of spiders anymore? Yeah. I lied! <laughs> Tragic tale of oh great. Oh Romeo! Oh Romeo! Why won't you acknowledge my existence? Oh mate, fancy seeing you here! Hey, it's the bone face man, skeleton dude who buys free drinks and stuff. That's my nickname around these parts. You alright, mate? Oh, how's it going, bone face skeleton dude who buys free drinks and stuff? Good, thanks, mate. See ya. Told ya. So, uh, I've got a matter that I've got to discuss with you, child. If it's concerning the bill, do not worry. I definitely will not be paying for any of it. Nah, mate, nah. I see you've been killing some residents down here. Those are all accidents, are you kidding me? Very clumsy people down here. <sighs> well, all I'm gonna tell you, mate, is that if you keep going on the way you're going, you are gonna have a bad time. Because the way you're drinking, you'll be so hungover, this is gonna be absolutely awful. Bad times all around. I'll drink to that. Cheers. Cheers. Let's get smart. Well, this could be a problem. You know what? I'm gonna risk it for a chocolate biscuit. Banania. Whoa. Hey, uh. Oh, can you just not? It's funny. Alphys is actually a really big bitch. Trust me, I'm fully aware. All the traps and the lasers and shit, she reactivated. Cool. And she wanted to be part of your adventure. Well, I mean, that's kind of irrelevant now. Why? Alphys is dead. Why? Yeah, she was walking, tripped over, fell on the phone, went straight through her skull. Very unfortunate. But I wanted to kill Alphys. I mean, you never know. She might have survived. Try calling her. Okay. No answer. That's a shame. Regardless, you're a dick, so I'm gonna kill you anyway. Somehow I just knew you were gonna say that. When there's my transformation! <laughs>
So what are you now? The non-pedophilic version of Michael Jackson? I am fabulous! That's very stereotypical and offensive to gay people everywhere. I'm not even gay! Well, then it's just offensive in general. Actually, you know what? I take that back. You take that back? Yeah. You see, when I was at school, I had a teacher, and she taught me, you should never judge someone based on the way they speak, because they can't help how they speak. They can't help where they're brought up. Same time, though, that teacher was a rhino that escaped the zoo. Nobody can understand her apart from her son, who's in the same class as us. She'd be like, Argh! Some reason he could talk English. Pretty impressive for a rhino child, though, I'll tell you that. Okay, I'm convinced. That's what I thought. Have a good day. You tell. That's sweet, uh -huh, uh -huh, I like it, uh -huh. How you liking this black and white house? You know, you're lucky I didn't get a restraining order against you. Or I can add that to my collection, child. I can't even get 20 yards in front of Beyonce. To be fair, our ass takes up that much space. I got a story for you, child. You see, a while ago, a human fell down here and... Will you stop walking up when I'm telling my story? Sorry, I'm just really hungry. I'm looking for food. Here, take this. Ah, uh, uh, here's the deal. If I give you this, you've got to sit down and listen to my story. Ugh. The story ends anyway with the conclusion being that you're my junk deox. I take that as a compliment. Ah, uh, stupid giraffe. Hello? Moses? Anyone of religious descent? Would you like to hear the powers of Jesus Christ? Um, Just kidding, mate! Ha ha ha! Tell you what, my head is pounding. It's like someone got a hammer right and my head is my ex-wife and they're just smashing it over and over. I'm guessing that's why she's an ex-wife. Anyway, as goes up ahead, mate, this will be the biggest challenge you've faced. Will you leave the underground or will you go back to the surface? Well, the surface, obviously. Oh, no, mate. I was just trying to make it more, you know, dramatic or whatever. Very dramatic. Almost as dramatic as your sex life. <laughs> Well, I mean, I say dramatic, but there's no drama there because it's non existent. Whoa! He's done me! You know what, Sans? I legit thought you were the biggest loser ever at first. Oh, cheers, mate. You know what? You're actually alright. <laughs> You're gonna make me cry, buddy. Please don't cry, please. <laughs> Sans, don't. Uh... <laughs> no, you just ruined it. You've ruined it. You've just. You've ruined it. Ah! <laughs> I'll be there in a sec, honey. Keep yourself warmed up till I get there. <laughs> oh, I am. Don't worry. Uh, where's the maid? I have no idea, but I'm sure she's in bed right now feeling very unsatisfied. Sorry, I was watering my flowers. Anyway, howdy. Would you enjoy a cup of tea, by the way? I don't drink tea. I have some vodka in the fridge. Would that do? You read my mind. That's dandy. Follow me. Wow, what is this? This is what keeps us all trapped underground. Well, then. So where's the vodka? Oh, I lied to get you in here. You son of a bitch! So now I must kill you. You kill me, I'm gonna kill you! You lure me in here with promises of vodka and there's nothing! How dare you! You know what, screw you, I'll be right back. Okay. Are you coming or what? Not now, maid lady. Such a jerk. Guess who's back? Now you must die! Your flowers are all gone. Huh? Yeah, I just stand on them all. What? Now we're even. This... This wounds me so. So that is how it is. The entire underground devoid of hope. The future had once again be taken. I just want to read comic books all day and play Nintendo. Well, damn, I mean, I love a bit of Mario Kart. If I give mercy on you, will you play me? And if I win, you've got to buy me that bottle of vodka. That sounds like a wonderful idea. Hmm? What the balls is that? No! My free vodka! You idiot! Did he seriously just die from you? A flower? What was his name again? Asgore? More like Asgore. Am I right, lads, or am I right, lads? You are right, lad. I know I'm right, lads. In this world, it's kill or kill, be, killed, kill, be, kill world. You need to learn how to construct a sentence. Now I got all the human souls, and if I kill you, child, I'll be a god. Now watch my demonic television. What is this? It's my own TV show. It's called Flowey the TV Show. Excellent. How many episodes are there? 72. Yeah, I'm not really much of a binge watcher, to be honest. You're gonna sit here, child, and watch my TV show. Okay. I'm doing the last bit, you. Oh, kill me. Um, no. Did the daffodil really kill that rose? I don't know. I guess you'll see in the next episode, child. I tell you what, I'm getting proper into this. It's quite quiet, though. Do you mind if I turn up a little bit? Go ahead, child. Okay. Yeah, 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 yeah. Oh, no, what do I do? What do I do? What do I do? You press the action button. Are you serious? I'm really sorry, man. I was trying to turn the volume up. No! <laughs> Flowey, I... Legit, I didn't mean to do that. I'm actually really liking the TV show. I reckon if you put this on Netflix, it'll be a massive hit. Ugh. You really think so? 100%. Well, I guess I'll see you then. <sighs> We're finally here. The way out of the underground. 
This has been one hell of a journey, but now it's time for me to go home. What? Hello! Where am I? You are in underground heaven! Where now, you can live an eternity with us! No. Yes! Everybody you killed will be here! Look, it's your cat from when you were a child! <laughs> He's happy to see you! Oh, I gotta tweet this out. No. <laughs> no. No!